Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video I am very excited about because we're gonna be testing a brand new website together, you and I. Um, I have a box next to me full of goodies from the website everything5pounds.com. And everything really was £5pounds.com. I really don't know what to expect. I'm really excited, but I honestly don't know what to expect because five pounds is really, really inexpensive. If you do live in the US, that's roughly $6.50, I think. So really inexpensive. I made sure I got shoes, I got a dress. I'm pretty sure I got jeans. I tried to get a little bit of everything so that we could see what it was all like because five pounds for shoes is insane. Five pounds. Oh, it's heavy. It's really, really heavy. Okay, so this is my box. And as it says on there, when it's gone, it's gone. They don't lie about that. I saw a pair of shoes that I really wanted and uh, I waited a few days and then they were gone. So if you do see anything on everything five pounds, make sure you buy it straight away before it disappears and you never see it ever again. Please let me in. Mm. Ooh, what is that? This looks cute. I will say, as per usual, I have forgotten some of the items I have bought. Um, apologies. Ooh, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm really freaking excited. <gasps> okay, I've just seen an item that was from the homeware section. I didn't even know they had a homeware section. They do. I bought an item from the homeware section. I've just seen it. It's adorable. Okay. I'm really excited for this video. This is my first item. It's a little skirt. I feel like I need to keep reminding myself that these things were five pounds because it is a little skirt, as I'm sure you can see, with denim trim and denim down the center with little gold buttons. These aren't like actual buttons. They're kind of just stuck on. And then the cutest little multicolor pattern in pastel. And I'm obsessed. I really, really hope this fits. It looks good. The zip is, ooh, the zip's good quality. I feel like that's always a tester. When the zip is poor quality and you can't get it down, that's really frustrating. The zip feels good. Let's, let's try this on. I will say it's not gonna go with this t-shirt, so bear with. All right, let's twist this into a little thing so it's out of the way. Are we good? We're good. Right little bit obsessed with this skirt. It is a tiny little bit big around my waist, but nothing a few stitches can't fix. It's so cute. Really, really cute. I really like it. Okay, I'm already impressed with this because five pounds, I feel like on other websites, this would be maybe 15, 20? And it looks really fancy, or at least I think it does. I thought everything five pounds was just clothing and fashion. Turns out they have a homeware section. Turns out they have cushions. Turns out this is freaking adorable. Look at this. And it includes the cushion. I partially thought I was just gonna get the cushion cover. No, no, cushion is included. <gasps> it's beautiful. Oh my gosh. And it's soft and it has a cushion in it. Okay, we're two for two. Both have thumbs up. We're gonna now deep dive into the rest. I feel like I'm gonna have to go a little bit quicker just because there's a lot in here. We all know it wouldn't be a jazzy bum haul if I didn't at least attempt to get a play suit in there. So a lot of the play suits weren't fully my style. This one is a little pajama play suit. So I wasn't gonna say no. It's also pastel purple, so yes. And it looks soft and cozy and I'm very excited. It's really cute. I'm excited to try this on. So this is the play suit. It is a little bit thinner than expected and not quite as soft as expected. It is soft, it is soft, just not, I was expecting kind of a hoodie material, but it's not quite that, but it is soft. Um, it also has a little hood with a little sheer uh, leopard print. Is it leopard print? It's an animal print of sorts, but I didn't notice this on the pictures. The center of the little circle things is actually the same lilac that the play suit is. That's a really cute little detail. It also has the leopard print in the little pockets. Of course it's got pockets. And then there is a little tie string around the front. So let's try this on. Oh, and the zip's good. Yeah, um, I'm a big fan. This 
is right up my street. If you've watched my videos for a while, you will know. Play suit, yes. Pastel colours, yes. Casual clothing, yes. And last but not least, something that always tips the scales. We have pockets. <laughs> this is like <sighs> five pounds. This is the perfect little round the house, casual, comfortable, got pockets onesie. Um, yes. Just, yep. Yeah, I mean, it's, this is, pff, wow. I'm scared to go any further because so far, everything has been so good, I don't want to ruin it. We're three for three. Something has to come up now that isn't perfect, surely. Jeans. I feel like this is gonna be very, very hit or miss because jeans for five pounds? Okay, did I get jeans or are these treggings? I have just looked at my order and these were definitely jeans. I did see a lot of treggings and jeggings and joggers on the website and I wanted to make sure that I got jeans. So these are definitely sold as jeans. I feel like they are very much closer to jeggings or treggings as opposed to jeans. They're not the kind of tough denim material. They're very, very soft. They feel good quality, but to me, they're not quite jeans, if that makes sense. So this is what they look like. I would have preferred a darker wash. However, they didn't have the darker wash in my size or my style. So I just went ahead and got these. So they do say on them, super soft, skinny. I could be getting it wrong, but I feel like this is more of a jegging. I don't know. Let me know in the comments what what defines a jegging and then and then we'll know it's not the best zip i was really impressed with the last two but this zip isn't the best and we have threads they are nice and skinny i do like my skinny jeans Ooh, these may be a little bit too skinny for me yep these don't fit me <sighs> okay we have our first no i am very very sad as i'm sure you can tell these are just too small for me around the waist I just, I don't want to force these to do up, but also they are too long for me on the leg. There's a bit of bulking around the ankle. I know that some people really like that look. I actually prefer like ankle grazer jeans. So these are going to be a no from me. However, I will say I like the color a lot more than I thought I would. Like this teal is a lot nicer on than I thought it was when I was holding it up. So maybe I'll invest in some teal jeans. The next item is a simple black uh, bodycon mini dress. I definitely feel like this is the type of item I just need to try it on. I don't feel like I can say much about it until it's on. So we're gonna put it on, then we'll discuss. Dress is on and I'm very glad I didn't comment on it before I put it on because I was definitely gonna say something about the fact that it's sheer. And now that it's on, it's not sheer. It's perfectly fine. I'm even wearing a light bra underneath and I don't believe you can tell. I love these little leather panels. They are very, very cute and the dress fits so nicely. I really, really like it. It's soft, it's comfortable, it's hugging me nicely. It's a good little black dress. And it was five pounds. I feel like I can't complain because five pounds for a dress is insanity. Just insanity. Next item is, I believe, a little checked shirt in a lilac slash blue mix. Okay, how do I get into this? Dun -dun 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 -dun. So this is the next item. It is a little uh, lilac checkered shirt. It's very cute. It has rolled up sleeves. I'm not too sure if these are full length. We will check. I think they'd be full length for most people. As we've discussed previously, I seem to have long arms. So we're not gonna wear these full length. We will keep them rolled up. And this whole outfit was 10 pounds, which is crazy. But also this shirt is so cute. I am a big fan of a checkered shirt but I feel like sometimes they err on the side of farmer. This is adorable. I really, really like this color on a check shirt. I don't feel like I've seen a lilac check shirt before and it's really, really cute. And it can go with this little outfit or you can have it undone and wear it with jeans. The quality is decent and I really, really love the colors. So another yes, I feel like aside from the jeans, everything's been good. I think this is a dress. We will see. Ooh. Okay, the fabric feels good. 
What are you? Oh, it's a little wrap around. Okay, let me take my shirt off and we'll put this round. So something I've noticed is that almost every piece that I've tried on has been from a different brand. So the dress that I'm wearing, I think is only Star. And then this is from Lusa Paris. So I'd assume that the quality is more dependent on the brand than the website, if that makes sense. This feels pretty decent. Hello. <laughs> how does this, how does this work? Are we, how are you? Does it matter? I don't know how it meant to, oh. I just can't. Does this work? Is it meant to sit symmetrically or are you meant to just da -da, and just let it go with the flow? <laughs> okay, I'm having a little bit of trouble. I can't work out whether it's fine to just be like this and it's just chill or whether you're meant to actually make it fall in a certain way whereby it's kind of symmetrical on both sides. I really like this, I really do, however, I feel like I'm the type of person who would constantly be fussing with it to try and make it symmetrical all the time when I think it's just meant to be thrown over and however it falls, it falls, it's really casual but kind of dressy at the same time. But I just feel I'd constantly be trying to make it fall symmetrically. Do you know what I mean? I don't own anything quite like this and I do think it adds a little bit something to the outfit and makes it look a little bit more stylish without any effort. This just went over my shoulders and I do feel a little bit more put together. I feel like you could even put a little belt around it. This is quite cute. I forgot, I forgot that I got a jacket to go with that skirt from before. Oh my goodness. You know the first little skirt that I pulled out? Um, it's actually a co-ord and I forgot that I got the jacket with it, but I did. This is something, oh, oh, they're actually poppers. I do have to say, out of all of the items that I've tried on, this definitely feels kind of the best quality. Um, it has a little bit of lining in there. It feels a little bit heavy, a little bit structured. This definitely feels like the most value for money out of everything. I would not expect to get this for five pounds. So this little jacket obviously matches my little skirt. So I'm gonna go ahead and get changed into my cold outfit which I'm excited for and also feel like is way too fancy for me, but we're gonna try it anyway. I don't feel like I'd ever choose to wear this outfit, but now I'm in it. I feel like a whole new personality is kind of coming through. I kind of want to walk like this now and talk in a very posh accent. It's so lovely to meet you. I just assumed that this was a co-ord, but I've looked back at my order confirmation and she's wearing the skirt with a top and then the top with like jeans. She's not wearing them together. I've gone full, full force here. We're wearing them together. We look classy, don't we? What are you? <gasps> Ooh, cute, a little dress. Ooh, and it's got a little... <coughs> is a little uh, dark gray dress. It looks kind of bodycon, and then it's got this little crossover detailing in the front, which is really, really cute. And then it is also high necked. So we will try this on. We will see what it looks like. I kind of don't want to take this outfit off. I actually like it a heck of a lot more than I thought I would. Like I kind of don't feel like I belong in it, but now I'm in it, I feel like this is where I should have been all my life. Why haven't I always worn outfits like this? Dress is on and I don't feel like I've got too much to say about this. It fits nice, it looks cute, it's comfortable, it's doing a good job of looking good. I do like the little crossover in the front. It's another thumbs up from me. I'm really surprised by this website. This dress is really nice. Five pounds, outfit for the evening done. It's nice, it's good, yes, thumbs up for me. We're now onto our first pair of shoes and I feel like it could go downhill from here because shoes for five pounds, shoes. Okay, so this is from a company called Coolway and they are, how are these five pounds? Five pounds. What? <laughs> How are they five pounds? <laughs> what? These are cute. They fit nicely, they're comfortable, and they're shoes for five pounds? I do feel like I need to say that I am taking into consideration the five pounds when I'm rating all of these items. For example, these shoes, incredible for five pounds. They look good, they feel comfortable, they're cute, just they're great. I do think if I'd spent 60 pounds on these shoes, I wouldn't be as impressed. Like you can tell they're not top quality, but they don't seem like five pounds quality. They seem really good. 
So, wow. Let's move on to another pair of shoes. So, I saw on the website that they had a denim heels, and I thought I'd just go ahead and see how they were. That's a good quality zip. Let's see if they fit. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, these are not my style and I really don't feel like they go with this dress. However, quality wise, cannot complain about these heels. These are really, really nice heels for five pounds. Five pounds! I am most impressed with these. These are really, really nice. Like, just, just really good quality shoes. And the zip. The zip as well. It's just a good zip. Okay, I think these are a pair of joggers. Someone is messing with me. These joggers are really cute, really soft, really comfortable. They have a little elasticated waistband and pockets. What the heck? Oh, they are a little bit short. <laughs> They are a little bit on the short side. Can we pull them down? Okay, aside from the fact that I want to wear them a little bit higher up, which does make them a little bit short for my legs, apart from that, how are these five pounds? These are really, really nice joggers. Like, really comfortable, really soft. I can squat in them and they pass the squat test. These are really nice. You guys know that I love finding strange fashion items and sharing them with you um, to get your opinion on what I think is strange. So I saw these and I just added them straight to my basket. They didn't have them in my size, but I just really feel like I had to show you these shoes. <laughs> Look at these. What on earth? Who is wearing these? And where are they wearing them? Please let me know in the comments. Like. If you like these, where are you wearing them? Like clubbing? Or raving? Or like a special type of festival? What is going on here? They do feel very good quality. They are solid. They are good quality. But what the heck is going on at the back? Who's wearing this and where? Please let me know in the comments. What's, what, what's happening here? They look really nice. Ooh. They look really nice. They feel like good quality. They're a brown suede material, little buckle on the side and tassels hanging down. They seem pretty good. The zip is stuck. Ooh, the zip is not brilliant. Okay, they feel like a good quality pair of heels. They feel pretty comfortable and they feel really solid. Like they don't feel like they just break on you when you're walking down the street. However, the zips are just not the best. They're kind of hard to get up and down. Once they are up, they work perfectly fine and the boots are really quite nice. But the zips just don't match the quality of the shoe. That wasn't too bad, was it? Okay, so that is everything that I picked up from everything5pounds.com. Let me know what you think of all the items in the comments. Let me know if you've ever shopped there before. Let me know if you're interested in shopping there. I feel like aside from a couple of the items which could do with the tweaking, I'm really impressed with the website. I really, really am. If you did enjoy this video, give it a big thumbs up for me. It'll make me super duper happy. Um, leave me a comment down below to respond to and I will see you guys very, very soon. Love you, bye.